just made up a new song. It's called You. You. What'd you say again? You. <laughs> it's a beautiful day out here today, friends. Not that much humidity in the air. It's actually kind of cool. Not, hey, that's pretty cool, but cool temperature wise. I'm about to see if this gentleman right here can bring me down to the bus station so I can go to Bangkok. So, what do you got? Uh, bus station? Tao Lai. 40 baht. Okay, bye. All right, friend, here at the airport, but my buddy's flight does not land until 1.10. I was gonna go to a coffee shop that's way on the other side of Bangkok, but to be quite honest about it, I don't feel like riding all the way over there. And so I'm headed on over to Nana Plaza to get some pancakes and some coffee and read my book for a little while. All right, y'all. I was gonna go shoot some pool, but I decided against it. Actually, I just went and had a one hour foot massage and now i'm gonna jump back on the bts and head back to the airport it's about 20 minutes after one my guess is his flight landed already i think his flight number is 605 let's head on up here to the second floor as far as i know he doesn't know i'm here the good thing is i think he's about 6'2 or 6'3 and he probably weighs 250 he's a massive dude so when he comes through it should be easy to spot <laughs> what's going on man Good to see you, bro. Up, Don? You look good, man. Thank you, sir. Saw them 100Ks. Shit. I'm still a fat boy. No, you ain't. I took that title because <laughs> I'm the fat boy. <laughs> she told us wait five minutes and then come back to her. Kapunkap. Kapunkap. Kap. That's a smoking outside. Okay. I don't smoke, but Aaron smokes. So we're going to stand out here while he smokes and wait for her to take us back to Pattaya. That's big homie right there, man. This is my second brother. She got a little mosquito bite back there, yeah. A little bitty. Yeah, y'all probably can't see that. We could see it when she was walking though. Was cuffing just a little bit. Okay, friends, this is the Altera Hotel and Residence. Pretty nice room. King size bed, small little kitchenette, essentials in the bathroom. It's got a fairly decent sized balcony. You can see the pool, but it's not a great view of the pool. If I'm not mistaken, my buddy said he paid about 210 bucks for four nights. So just a pinch over $50 a night. Location wise, if you were to come out of the hotel, turn left and walk to the end of the soy, you are essentially diagonal from soy six. Are you gonna get some rest or are you gonna get something to eat or what are you doing? Uh, I'll take a shower, change, and then hit the six. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on, friends? I'm here at one of my favorite spots, Cloud Nine Reloaded. I like to come here to shoot pool. They have two very nice, level, clean pool tables here. So a lot of times during the week, I come early in the day. They open at 11, so I like to come around that time because there's usually nobody here. You can have a table all to yourself. I might shoot for an hour or two. And the thing that I like about this place is they don't charge by the hour for the pool table. They do have staff here if you would like to have a shooting companion. And usually if one of the girls plays, I'll either buy them a drink or after we've played five or seven games, I'll tip them a hundred baht. So up to you. Sometimes I've done both. I've bought them a drink and I've tipped them a hundred baht. Another thing I should mention is they usually will have live sports. So if you come in and there's any type of game or race, any type of sport that you want to watch, just let them know and they'll put it on the screen for you. So right now they've got a big soccer match going on. Sometimes they have Formula One. I'm pretty sure once American football starts, They'll probably have that up. Now, today is a Sunday, and at three o'clock on Sundays, they have killer pool. They're probably getting ready to start, so I'm gonna head on in here and see what's what. Two lives, depending on how many people it is. Yeah, if there's under, if there's only 15, we do three lives. Anything over sort of 15, we do two lives. Okay. Um, if you break, you get two shots. You get the break and then one shot on. Okay. Uh, and if you pop the golden ball, you get a little cocktail shot for free. Pop the golden ball on any shot, on not, any not just shot. not just the break. Not just the break. If the golden, it's like instead of a normal black ball, it's an eight. Golden ball, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. But you don't get an extra life. You get a shot. Yeah. Okay. okay. Your name was? I'm sorry. Mark. Mark. And that's Ting. Ah. Hello, Ting. Hello. <laughs> That's usually who I shoot with when I come early in the day, team. And I don't know if you caught that or not, but the entry fee for Killer Pool is 100 baht. As he mentioned, because it's under 15 people, we're getting three lives. This is the first time I've ever played Killer Pool, so I'm learning as I go. Looks like Mark has got everything under control, though. <laughs> for the, for the <laughs> 
Number nine, Phil. I was the first out. I lost all three of my lives. But my consolation prize is they gave me a free shot. <laughs> What's going on, friends? Another beautiful day out here in Thailand. I am at Khao Pa Ku in Si Racha. I came up here to go to a movie, but I had to make a pit stop in Pattaya before I came here. And I ran into a little cutie. So I took her to breakfast and I was like, hey, I'm going to Si Racha. You want to go? She said, sure. So she went back to her place, took a shower, and then we came on out here. I was going to go to a movie at 11 o'clock, but because of the alterations in my plan, I had to switch to the one o'clock show. So I figured since we had a little bit of time, we could stop at this monastery and check it out. Looks like it has very nice views of the city. And like most Thai temples that I've been to, the, the decoration, the sculptures, statues, etc., are always something cool to look at. All right, so you gotta leave your shoes at the bottom of the stairs and they give you some flip flops to put on. Then you can come on up here. Beautiful view out here. Ocean over here, big Buddha statue here, city out here. Soy mak mak right there. <laughs> Back out here, central Sriracha. Got myself a mango smoothie. You want some of my smoothie? You can have some if you want some. What do you think? Tastes pretty good, don't it? Tastes awesome. With yet another one calling me fat to my face. I'm trying on a belt. She told me I got a baby. I say, I uh, mak mak. She said, no, no mak mak. So uan, but just not mak mak. Huh? You tell me, you tell me I uan. Mine or uan. But have baby. I have baby, she said. Long, long yet. You have Apple phone? No, I have Oppo. <laughs> Let's see what we got going on over here. Mission Impossible. Dead Reckon in Part 1. Press a button. Please touch the screen. Cup on cup. We got some tickets right here, man. Go sit on the couch and watch a movie. 